guys, um, today I'm going to do my favourite OPI nail varnishes and I absolutely love red nail varnishes so I have a lot of those but um, yeah I have quite a few OPI nail varnishes too and clearly I love them all but if I was to choose about five of them um, these ones would be it. So I love this colour and it's called Got the Blues for Red and it's so great. It's not a bright apple red and um, it's not a typical red, it's just one of those deep vampy reds and so that's what makes it really special. And the name is really quite perfect for it because I do believe it has like a sort of a bluish black undertone which gives a great great depth to the colour and it just looks more intense and this looks so good on short nails and even longish nails too so yeah I know there are loads of reds out there and sometimes when you're looking for a red you know it can get quite overwhelming you're like well they all look the same just give me a red so I hope I helped you by saying get this one really really great cover color I love it and whenever I'm indecisive um, I just go for this one and it just always wins so yeah and then um, from the Linkin Park series, I have Linkin Park at Midnight and this is just your original deep plum night colour. I love it. It's one of my favourite colours. I've had this for over three years now and I've only used that much and I wear it quite a lot and it's just really, really great. It has silver sparkles. I'm not sure if you can see. Um, but it has slight, slight shimmer and that's basically, I think, the difference between Linkin Park After Dark and Linkin Park at Midnight. Anyway, I love this one um, and I think everybody should have this sort of colour in their collection. And then also in the red um, collection is this one and this is great. It's a really extravagant colour and it's most um, what's it called? It's called, yeah, Most Honourable Red. And this is just such a special colour because, as you can see on camera, it can kind of look orangey coral. And yeah, it kind of tricks your eye in that sense because some days it can look really like orangey um, coral colour and then some days it can look like a true red. And it kind of reminds me of my Carmex lid. You know how if you see a Carmex tube and you see the lid, it kind of looks like that. So yeah, um, that's just a very weird comparison right there. But yeah, I, I love this colour. I, I think it's so unique. I sometimes even see a bit of pink in it. So yeah, it's really, really cool. And definitely check this out because I think you girls will really like that one actually. And then of course I have to add a pink because we all love pink, right? And it's Short's Story. And this is just such a fun, vibrant pink colour. Um, it's basically Barbie's best friend. <laughs> and I think this also has like a blue-purple undertone to it. And um, you can kind of see that when um, you look at it in real life. And it's kind of like a milky pink, which is really what I like. Now I'm looking for basically this pink, but maybe two, three shades lighter but still with an intensity. So if you know something like that, let me know because I've been on the search for that sort of colour for ages and I just haven't found a right one, so yeah. And this is so girly, I love it. And every time, you know, I go out with my girlfriends or I like to catch a movie with them, I put this on my nails and it kind of just fits the theme. So I love this colour, really, really fun. And then my favourite colour of them all, and you've heard um, me talk about this in my really early videos, um, and that is Parlez-vous OPI, and this is just such a special colour. I know there are um, a lot of colours out there, um, I don't know who does it, um, yeah, OPI itself has brought out a very few similar colours to this one, and um, I'm sure China Glaze and Sephora by OPI have them too, but I really like this one out of them all, and you could probably say this looks quite similar to Do You Lilac It, which is also another famous OPI colour. And I have that too. So there they are, side by side. And there is a difference, right? <laughs> this one, Do You Lilac It, is a brighter purple lavender, and I love this colour. But I prefer Parlez-vous OPI, and it's just a more dirtier, sort of greyish undertone sort of colour. And this looks great on short nails. And, um... 
yeah, I don't think you can go wrong with this one either. So those are my five favorite OPIs. Aren't they gorgeous? I really love these colors and I'd be very happy with just having these five in my collection because despite having quite a lot, I always rotate with these colors. And yeah, these are kind of my go-to colors when I'm indecisive. So I hope that was helpful and please let me know if you have like any cool favorite OPIs. I think you guys know me by now so I'm sure you'll pick out some great colors and I'll go and check them out and maybe buy them. So I'll talk to you soon. See you in the next video. Bye!